UC Merced men's soccer team is quietly building a reputation as a dominant program in the NAIA. The Bobcats are coming off four straight trips to the national championship tournament, despite coming into existence less than a decade ago. This year's squad is poised to make another run at the postseason, led by a senior who first grabbed headlines while helping McLean High win a Valley title in 2016. Juan Flores is a coach's dream. Put him anywhere on the pitch and he'll make plays for you. He's very often the focal point of the other team's defense, so we will move him around. We'll put him out on a wing a little bit. Sometimes we'll push him a little higher as a forward. Out in front is Juan Flores, has the keeper to be his left footed shot, got it! A natural attacking midfielder, Flores' vision and playmaking ability has helped the Bobcats to a conference best 5-1 record, while leading the team with nine goals this season. You got to take the ball sometimes and you got to make your own plays, but you have to also look at the players around you and if there's a better chance, why not give it to them? Playing in the middle of the park demands great creativity. UC Merced coach Albert Martins calls him the team's engine. The way he uses his body and ball skills to fend off defenders, but can slip into open space when play allows to slot one past the goalkeeper. He, he can move you around a bit and he plays chess with you. Um, and to where, you know, you think you got to be in a physical battle, and then he's just right by you. Um, so I, I would say, you know, his size matching up with his skill is really what sets him apart from, you know, anybody else we've had here. A sought-after recruit coming out of McLean, where he was named the North Yosemite League Player of the Year twice, Flores says he had his pick of colleges, but fell in love with the campus at UC Merced and the young program's direction. I like moving the ball, I like playing with people, like I like touching around and stuff like that. And most of the big schools that were like trying to offer me were usually like the kickball schools, and I didn't want to play that. So when I talked to Coach Marins, I kind of like I understood his philosophy. The business major's dedication to the school has never wavered and decided to return for one more season. College athletics were all granted an extra year of eligibility because of COVID. I feel like UC Merced's a part of like my life now, and I, I just felt like I needed to give back because they have gave me so much opportunity, and here was opportunity for me to give back. The program's all-time assist leader says he's focused on leading the Bobcats into the postseason before deciding on what the future might hold. I would love to, you know, play the next level and pursue the dream that I've had as a kid. The Bobcats have two regular season matches left on the schedule, beginning with Friday's home game against Pacific Union, where Flores will look to improve on his career goal mark and win his second straight Conference Player of the Year award. For Good Sports, I'm Jason Oliveira, ABC 30 Action News. Thank you for watching. For more videos like this from ABC 30, just make sure to hit that subscribe button below.